Hello, Dan Devoni here. Uh, this is a short uh, video where I want to encourage you to have your students use PowerPoint less as a presentation tool and more as a tool to display to the process they're using uh, to develop content, to work out their design, and make it really a, a portal so you can see their whole process. <clears throat> what I've done here is I made a short, short slideshow about the egg hallway, and I've added comments uh, to each slide. So for example, my, my first slide gives a rationale of why I'm, I'm, I'm using four pictures. My, my second slide is a new first slide, and I've given a rationale that I think the, the symbol is better suited to the slideshow. My third slide is my third version of a first slide, where I've cropped it more and I've added a title. And my fourth slide is, again, a first slide with a rationale on the side that says, hey, now there's more room to write text. And for each slide I've done, I've done a couple of versions. Um, and I think it gives us, as a teacher and student, something to talk about as to why I chose an image, uh, why I placed it where I did, uh, why I used the font I use, uh, do I have a good resource? And, and I could save all of those. And all my work now, tr truly all my work, is here for you to see. And by my comments, you can see the way I'm thinking. And I think it's an effective use of the PowerPoint rather than as a, a final presentation tool where all that work is not shown. And because you can't be there for every student in the lab as they're making decisions, I think this, this portal to their process would be an effective means for you to better assess uh, their understanding and their skills. So you might want to give it a try. If you need any pointers, uh, stop down to see me, and I'd be glad to share some other ideas. Thanks.